I'm 18. Hi, I'm Pierce Spicer. I'm 18 years old, um, and I love musical theatre, singing, writing, uh, philosophy, and engaging in local politics. So going to rallies, um, going to door to door, uh, going to protests, uh, things like that, and encouraging people to vote and get involved with politics. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I just fucking killed Chuck. I mean, I think I did, because he's out there, and he's not moving, and I don't think he's breathing, and... <sighs> See, I was just out there, on the roof, with Marissa, and we were laughing, and talking, and having a great time, and then I tell her that she reminds me of Sandra Bullock, that I loved Hope Floats, and who would have thought those would be the magic words, because the next thing I know, her clothes are off, and we are loosing with shingles like there's no tomorrow. And there is kissing, and biting, and touching, and then suddenly someone is beating on me, like really beating! And I look up, and there is Chuck, and I say, what is your problem? And he says to me, the problem is, dude, you are fucking my girlfriend! So I say to Marissa, you're someone's girlfriend? And she says, no. And then it comes out that she isn't Chuck's girlfriend, he just wishes she was. And she's his cousin. That killed the mood a bit. So Marissa puts her clothes back on, goes back inside, and I'm left with Chuck! Blubbering, crying, whining Chuck about how he's this big fuck up and maybe he should just throw himself off the roof and for a second I'm thinking yes! Throw yourself off. I don't say that. I say to him, you're gonna get a girl buddy, just maybe not your cousin. And then I give him a friendly pat on the back, like a, like a real, a real manly one. I mean, he's a big guy. I didn't think he'd go flying right off the roof. Oh God. <sighs> so my main passion is world building and game making. So the most well known system that I make for is Dungeons and Dragons, but I also make for Savage Worlds, Pathfinder, and stuff like that. So I make a world uh, with history, religion, geography, maps, all sorts of things, and then my players play inside of it. Um, so I describe the scenes to them, describe the other people, play all the other characters, um, and yeah, I'm a player sometimes, um, but we meet um, every Monday, and it's just so much fun. Um, We've had, we have crazy adventures, crazy laughs, it's just a really great social experience as well as one that, that increases your imagination and creativity. A couple summers ago, myself and some family friends went on a canal boat holiday. We saved up for like three years and then we finally went on it. Um, but there's a rule where you can't move your boats after 11 and we had half an hour to get up two locks, turn the boat around and then go back down. So we all sprang into action and were doing different jobs. Um, because I was the youngest, I did a lot of running. So I ran about five miles total that day, um, opening the locks, um, seeing if things were clear. Um, and in the end, we just about managed to make it back down the second one. Uh, and then we moored the right way around and um, yeah, settled down for the night. I think National Youth Theatre is a fantastic opportunity to meet like-minded people, network for potential projects, and also meet people who are in the industry and get training and advice for, you know, actual practical theatre.